Right, so just set the frame out uh, so that you can choose any of the two legs uh, that will be become like the, the front of it. Um, you've got two of these fixings which I've put little stickers on each of the fronts that we've sent to you which will say uh, front right and front leg left. Right? Now So that's the way they go up with the biggest area at the top rather than at the bottom. And and so if the first thing you've got to do is just line up your front left and you'll have your sticker at the front then, yeah? So that, that'll be that one. And then they're handed so you've got a front right which will be the other side. Right. So when you pull these out, when you're just laying them down on their side, they're a bit stiff. So you might just need to give them a light tap out, just to get them started. Pull that out until it stops, where the little catch has come through, come through the hole. And, let, and just keep pushing the button in until it drops down. Then it drops in behind this black thing. So you have to lift, lift it up so that you can, it moves it down and this moves off a bit. Press that last one in and then it releases it. Right, so if you take your fitting That button obviously goes to the part of your leg which has got the holes, that's how it's going to go back. So this is the locator that pops out of each hole, so that's the way around for that. And then you've got your handed thing so that one part of it is facing across between these two front legs and the other part is going downwards. Um, and that part doesn't matter, but that's just the direction it's got to go with this little thing here Protruding out of the front But if you just look at your stickers that say in this case front left Line that up like that and that's it And what you have to do is take that so it's gonna meet up with the holes in this top part That meets up with the holes in the top part anyway Push that in there, depress that button, and again, and just let that drop on. Right, now I'll put that back in position, line it up so that the little button is on the same side as the holes in the top part of the leg. Slide it in, depress the button so that it aligns and pops out into that first hole. So the poppers drops out there, right? Then slide this black little piece up and just let that overlap the top part of the frame like that. Now, from that point there, that all fits the tabletop, the countertop. Then, where the counter is going to fit in there, you've got a, you've got then a, a support stay that comes down and joins this. And from this base here, the base plate, it measures either 555 millimeters or about 21 and three quarter inches. So that's 555 millimetres or 21 and 3 quarter inches. And the hole is facing in. You're drilling a hole so that it runs in in the direction of this of the other leg which forms the front. So 21 and 3 quarter inches hasn't got to be spot on, 
or just thereabouts and just pick your point roughly in the center of that and then just drill that through straight through this side and out the other side and all that that is is so as I say the tabletop is coming in here which you'll see on your training video a support bar comes down there and this hole with we're using a six millimeter drill bit that hole there will let your nut and bolt pass through this part of the leg and that's all there is to it right so after you've done that then you can just um, lift that back up to reveal the button again push it through and then just keep depressing that so that it clears all of the holes push it all back together again that's it